Hello, YouTube, man. This is Herp and Derp with another episode of Spy Vaults. We're back on Earth for some low level Spy Vaults. But hey, you to the next we'll get through all of four of the Earth vaults. So, here we have probably the most elaborate of all the vaults that DE has constructed for Earth. We have this vault here, which is called the Waterfall Vault. Nice. And it's going to be one of the, possibly the most difficult, too, in terms of being large. But it's also got a very large number of ways it can perform this vault. First of all, there's usually either a guard or a couple of sensor regulators. So I'm gonna see if I can take those out. First one down here. Now, if you're actually a low-level account playing on Cambria for the first time, uh, I would not recommend trying to take them out until you're at much closer range. But since I have a high-level pistol here, I can go ahead and take them out. Now, there are multiple different ways to perform this vault, depending on what objects you decide to interact with in this environment. It's actually a really cool, really well designed tile, which makes it kind of sad that it's not on any higher level missions than this. So, the first thing you can do is, uh, and we're gonna see if we can, we're gonna see if we can do it this way. We're gonna hack this panel right down here in, in this little water, and that's actually going to turn on some steam events. What those steam events are gonna allow us to do is they're gonna provide us. I don't wait for that. Provide us a nice one-way Whoa! Nope, nope, nope. Come on, baby. Yeah, nice one-way ride to the room we're supposed to be in. Which is always nice. So there you go. That's the fast way to do that vault, if you ever get into it. I've never seen enemies uh, get into positions where they pick you up as you make that very first steam jump. And I will point out that if you miss that jump, fall down, like, well, I'm trying to figure out where you go precisely when you miss that jump, probably just underneath, so somewhere like here, there's another steam vent over here, whoa, I missed it, okay, whatever, come on, I want to demonstrate for you, okay, let's just use half the repulsion, okay, so we're in this area now, where we can, for some reason, there's You're this little the pad here no that corresponds to being able to get onto this rope. I don't know if you actually can get onto that rope. Anyway, so there's another... There's another steam vent here to get onto. That launches you up all the way over this direction. A lot of times I end up landing on these little bars here when I'm on that steam vent. One thing I will point out is that the sensor and if it's in a bad position, we'll see you if you try and hit that point. So that can be a little annoying. Anyway, but you can then, once you're up there, or once once you're up over here, you can then go exploring. So there's actually a uh, rope you can take that will get you back. So there you have it. Now, is that the only way you can do this vault? Of course not. There are always many, many ways you can do the vault. So there's... This little room up in here, that's a nice little. And you know, let's just drop back down. See what we can. See what we can accomplish by dropping back all the way back to the to start. I'm trying to do this another way by interacting with some more objects. Well, if you look around, you might see these little things, which, as you know, you can interact with on Earth. And in this particular vault, we happen to. Shooting them happens to. A. Group one drop. Uh, most worthless resource ever. <laughs> and B, send all these little ramps for you to walk across. And now, I will recommend you go around and find all four of the little uh, animals, because these ramps are much easier to hit by the below. Hello, answer. I don't know what you're doing. I'll shoot you. And that makes the. That normally, if you don't know the secret of the ramps, you have to do all this annoying parkour to get around the room. And then once you're done, so then once you once you have those ramps out, it becomes a matter of simplicity to get through these little laser bars. You just wait for them to be up and juke them. Whee! All right, that lets you walk straight up this way, or uh, I believe we have the lower one. So I'll see if we get down there. Not quite. 
Yeah, well, I got the lower one. Is that where it's at? There we are. Oh, I would have set off the alarms there, but thankfully we're all right hacked. Isn't there a, uh... Isn't that where the little rope leads to? Oh, well. Not to worry about. I've shown you guys two different ways to... Ouch! Get through this vault, so... That's all for the uh, waterfall vault. Peace out, YouTube. Herp, derp, out. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. Before I give you the salutations, I should show you e the easiest way to get out, which is just to walk the little door there. All right, because some people know, because some people get confused by that first time they do the vault. All right, try again. Herp, derp, out. Peace out, YouTube. This has been Wolfram's Spy Vaults.